December 5th, 2008, I was diagnosed with cancer. Yes, me, of all people. How many times did I hear you? You can't have cancer. You're the healthiest person I know. Well, yes, I was, except for that small little fact called cancer. The other line I always heard was, well, geez, if you have cancer, then what in the heck do I have? Why am I still even here if you've got that? Because I don't do half of what you do. I really feel that everything happens for a reason. So you ask me then, why did you get cancer? Well, let me tell you, not only did I get one type of cancer, but I actually got two different types of cancer. Many people would feel that this was not only bad luck, but double bad luck. But really, it's all how you look at it. I had one type of cancer that didn't show up on a mammogram. And if I hadn't gotten the other type of cancer, which was more aggressive, I never would have known I had the first type, and it probably would have gone on to stage four or stage five before I realized it. I do believe everything happens for a reason. Many people have asked me over the years, for example, why do you work out? Why do you do so much? What are you training for? Well, I never had that answer till now, but I feel like I was probably working out for this cancer, this competition. This is the biggest competition I had in my entire life. And I do feel that I've succeeded and I do feel that I beat it because I have beat it because now I am cancer free.